<laughs> it's good to be back inside of my own transport. What do you want? Can't you not see I am busy currently? Ah, I see. So you bring me new subordinates. Very well. Bring them in. Hello. And what be your names? Mm-hmm. So you only go by a group's name, not your own? Interesting. You seem very cocky about your own organization. Do not waste my time. Tell me what you want. The Dragon Balls? So, you want me, Lord Frieza, tyrant of the universe, destroyer of planets, to give you one of the most powerful things ever created to you. Free of charge? No second wind actions are going to happen? Hmm? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Guards, dismiss of this group. I do not wish my time with them any more. Hmm? Something in return. What could you possibly grant me that's even greater than the Dragon Balls? An army? I have an army. <sighs> Look. You simpletons. I do not need more numbers in my army. It is clearly strong enough. Then clearly, you need more in your army. Or even maybe a higher up to tell you what to do. Which I am not going to be. So, you can take your army and your whole organization here and beat it. I told you not to waste my time. And so, for you to be doing so, I now sentence you as prisoners under the Lord Frieza's name. Guards! Arrest them and put them into the cells. Waste my damn time over an organization. I should have all of you beheaded. But... I am not going to do that. Because I need every single one of you, every single one of you, to be on my side. Because we are very, very close to controlling everybody in said planet. That we're rapidly approaching. And because, well, they have the last Dragon Ball that I need. 
So, after I get this Dragon Ball from their clutches, with force, or even with trade, I would just simply blow up their planet. <laughs> Leaving nothing but space particles and rocks floating in space forever. <laughs> It's a very good plan, on my own terms, if I do say so myself. What do I plan on wishing for? Well, if you must know, subordinate, I've realized something after hanging by a tree in Earth's hell. Everyone has been making fun of me for one Specific reason. I am small. In short, we have two wishes with the Dragon Balls, and I will be using one to wish myself to be exactly five inches taller. Why five inches, you say? Well, if I go over that, it'll be seems too noticeable. I want to see it as it is still natural, as I am still growing. And for the last wish, well... <laughs> the last wish, I wish is to revive all the villains those monkeys have destroyed. And I myself will take them under my wing. And when that happens, I will be the most strongest villain ever to be in the universe. Yes, everyone. And I do mean everyone. Everyone from... Goku... Prince Vegeta... Gohan... Every Saiyan... I want every single villain they have defeated alive. And by my side. And if they don't, well, they're clearly not strong enough to defeat me. So I'll just eliminate them. I did say that to those uh, hooligans that you brought in. But I don't need their army. I want to grow mine. In my own image. Do you understand? Hmm, very good. Now, subordinate, I would like you to rearrange the coordinates to Earth. Yes, I know we are very close to the planet, but it's not like that Dragon Ball's gonna go anywhere. It's under very heavy security on that planet. They worship the Dragon Balls like it's some type of god. When in reality, they have no idea what they're for. So, bring our ship to planet Earth. I would like to have a conversation with said Saiyans and tell them about my wish. But I'm not going to tell them where the Dragon Ball is. Yes, I know they have technology to find it. But... I feel like I will leave them a present before I leave Earth. So they have to deal with a bigger problem. <laughs> What are you standing there for? Go re-coordinate this ship to Earth!
get ready, Goku. Because I'm coming for you. And you won't expect what I bring. 